Now, 5 times the sum of 3 and twice the number is 105. What is the number? 5 times the sum of 3 and twice the number is 105. What is the number? Let's see, what does sum mean? Could you give me the sum of 10 and 2? What would that be? What's the sum of 10 and, 10 and 2? That would be 10 plus 2, right? Or 12, right? How can you get 5 times the sum of 10 and 2? 5 times the sum would be 5 times 12, wouldn't it? 60, right? Or you could also write it 5 times 10 plus 2, couldn't you? That would be 5 times the sum of 10 and 2. Does that make sense? The sum of 10 and 2 is 12. 10 plus 2, right? 5 times the sum of 10 and 2 would be 5 times 10 plus 2. So 5 times the sum of 3 and twice a number could be written um, 5 times the sum of 3. What's the sum of 3 and twice a number? It would be 3 plus what? The sum of 3 and twice a number. Twice a number, 2x. That would be twice a number, right? Is 105. How do you write is in math? Is equals 105, right? And then we solve it. So the first step would be to simplify both sides. And we can multiply 5 into uh, both sides. 5 times 3, 15. 5 times 2x, 10x equals 105. Then what? Subtract 15, right? We get 10x equals 90. And then what? X is being multiplied by 10, so divide by 10 on both sides, and we get x equals 9. And let's check that. 5 times the sum of 3 and twice the number is 105. 5 times the sum of 3 and twice 9 is 105, right? That's what we got to check. So 5 times 3 plus what's 2 times 9? 18. Is that 105? Um, let's see. What's 3 plus 18? It is 21. What's 5 times 21? Oh, I think that's 105, right? So we do indeed have 105 on both sides, so the answer is correct.